what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here in this video we're going to be going over how the creeper originally died in the once uh planned script for jeepers creepers 3 the jeepers creepers cathedral script that i'm sure a lot of you are familiar with as i've sent out emails to several of my subscribers uh again if i have not sent sent you one it's because i get a thousand not a thousand but like multiple comments a day and i just i just don't acknowledge all those comments so I'll, I will get to you when, if, if and when I ever notice it. If I don't notice it, again, I have social media, so you can always reach out to me there and ask for the script. I've sent it to several people who've reached out to me on social media. If you still want to uh, just leave a comment down in the comment section telling me that you want a copy of the script so you can go over it, and you do that as well. Um, and then for those of you who don't want to know how the creeper died or you don't want any spoilers, you want to actually read the entire cathedral script beforehand, just go ahead and click away from the video. But just to get into things, uh, so for those of you who have read the script, I'm sure you you have all seen how the creeper met his demise. Uh, so it's like the very final stages of the script, and we're in the final act with uh, Greg and Rowan, two characters mentioned in the cathedral script. Greg and Rowan, they were the ones that um, they're, they've discovered this, this cathedral, this old cathedral where the creeper has another one of the creeper's layers, many layers that he has. Uh, the creeper is basically returning back to that cathedral after he's been in a like a missile launch. I, I believe that's what they were shooting him. Like they were shooting a bunch of a bunch of missiles at him. He was just in a big fight with Taggart and several other people. Several several other people who were trying to take him out. Trish has now died at this point in the script, and the creeper is basically he he has fled from them because they nearly. They nearly just dis disabled him from being able to fly. Uh, he knows he's no match for them without his wings, really, because that's his that's his advantage, the ability to fly. Uh, so what hap what ends up happening is he drives back to back to the cathedral in his truck. Greg and Rowan are alerted by the truck. They go back and they run and hide into the cavern, into the cathedral, all the way back into the cathedral, and then they're they're hiding from the creeper. And then Greg is kind of preparing preparing something for it he has a gun and then he also has for some reason he has a c4 uh, i just I, again this is this is a movie logic movie movie scripts any anything to just have for self-defense i don't know why he had a c4 i probably need to go back and reread the script i don't think it's ever mentioned as to why greg had a c4 on him but hey if you want to feel armed by any means necessary I, I guess you can carry around a c4 <laughs> but anyway he's preparing a c4 uh, he puts his hand on on it and he has like a detonator for it as well to press the button to detonate and he tells rowan asks greg what he's doing and greg answers if it's a man i'm gonna shoot it and if it's something else i'm gonna i'm gonna blow it blow it the f up or something to that to that effect uh, the creeper comes walking into the cavern or into the cathedral into the lair wherever they are hiding and they 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 just watch as the creeper is like wailing out in pain he's letting out all these signature creeper sounds that we've come to know from him and he rips one of his wings off I, I believe he actually ends up losing both of his wings one of them falls off and the other one he rips off his wings are just like completely useless so he rips he rips them off uh, and then what ends up happening is he he like stumbles across the wall in pain Greg, for whatever reason, one way or another, just consumed with fear, not wanting to let, not wanting to wait for the creeper to, of course, take them out. Because I feel like he just feels like there's no other way out of here unless he does something first. He makes a move on the creeper. The creeper, creeper, of course, takes note of this. Greg basically gets into the creeper's face with a gun. He he makes himself visible. The creeper takes note of him. Um, also, in this in these final moments, the creeper's jaw is like completely. His jaw is wrecked. I believe it's his his bottom jaw. It's it's just like it's it's a a disturbing sight. We probably would decide if the if this film had actually got shot. His jaw is hanging, uh, but Greg makes himself known to the creeper. He, he's planning to shoot it. The creeper lunges at Greg, and the Greg is just shooting, 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 shooting. Of course, that's not going to do anything. The creeper jumps on him. He takes a bite into Greg. Uh, he eats. Pre pre presumably he, i don't think he really ate anything from him but he just takes a bite in him just takes several he takes several chunks out of greg's corpse and then he just throws he throws greg over towards where rowan is uh, and now rowan is scrambling to get away from the creeper there's a big just a big chase scene involved with them 
and i believe what he ends up doing is he he sees that greg still has the what he ends up finding is that greg had his arm removed greg's arm is ripped from his body he picks up greg's arm because it still has the c4 in it with his finger still on it and the detonator is somewhere in this cavern still as well greg with a plan in my or not Greg, but rowan rather with a plan in mind he he takes he takes greg's arm lunges at the creeper the creeper catches him in midair um and he he catches him in midair and what happens is he he's choking him and while he's choking him rowan decides to take greg's arm and shove it down the creeper's throat with the c4 all the way down to his forearm and then the creeper bites bites rowan's arm off he bites rowan's arm off and he has swallowed the arm with the c4 and he has also swallowed um rowan's arm which shoved the c4 down into the creeper's uh abdomen area now of course the creeper is not stupid he he struggles to reach for this to pull it out because he knows he, he again the creeper is not stupid uh he's struggling to pull whatever it was that rowan put into his throat pull it out and he ends up pulling out Rowan's arm, but he needs to get Greg's arm out of his body because Greg's arm had the C4. Rowan eventually crawls over to the detonator. The creeper is on the creeper is closing in on him. I believe he actually makes it onto his back at, at one point. But the creeper sees Rowan with the detonator now in his hand. And it's like a moment in moment in time where everything pauses. Uh, everything's frozen because we all know what's about to happen here. The creeper is he's he's frozen with fear essentially for for the first time the creeper is just frozen with fear i don't think we're actually gonna i don't think victor savile would have made it made it apparent that the creeper was scared but the creeper is just frozen with fear in in my mind because he knows what's going to happen once that detonator gets pressed rowan presses the detonator and the creeper just explodes his body's in pieces everywhere all around the cavern and that's how the creeper would have died he would have been exploded by a c4 um for those of you who have read the script let me know what you think about that down in the comment section below i feel like this would have been a very uh dramatic and action-packed final scene to see with the creeper and see his demise uh let me know what you think about it down in the comment section below if you haven't already make sure you subscribe and turn on post notifications so you never miss a video in the description i'll have links on my social media accounts my facebook twitter and instagram uh, down in the comment section below i'm gonna have a link uh, to the facebook group you can go ahead and join that Facebook group if you would like to stay updated on Jeepers Creepers and just discuss anything horror related. Uh, give the video a thumbs up, subscribe, turn on post notifications. And with all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.